We're in Hibernia Processing. Welcome back. Viewers. And uh, we're on uh, day six. And we're uh, looking at how to occupy the last uh, five or so hours. And uh, where we have, uh, I'm just looking at our food. Grab the uh, few tools here. And I uh, don't think we need this right now. We'll put that back. Take the hacksaw and the. Uh, we have the big hammer already, so that's good. We have lantern for exploring. We'll put these torches away. Okay, we're ready to go. We're lagging a little bit. Not sure why, but... Okay, we need to eat a little bit and drink, obviously, we'll do that. Better short this, sort this by condition. is 45% so we need to rest at some point. We still have a lot, a lot of uh, gas left in the tank and two hours of daylight left so let's uh, break up a few I don't know about this table. Could take a long time. It would take three hours by. Yeah. How much metal do we get? Eight metal. It's a lot of metal. Let me just pick up this wood while we still have a little bit of light here.
turn a table, we can break these down. Take this and leave it downstairs by the fire barrel because we're going to need to make water the next time. And this is 42. you over here.
quite warm. Uh, it's minus one out in the uh, trailers outside. It's also minus one inside of the uh, bear uh, wolf cave. stuff. Hopefully this won't give us food poisoning. That really brings our calories up. It used to be in the past if you didn't remember to eat or drink, and you went to sleep, you could end up starving to death. It's about 13 hours of daylight left, so let's sleep for uh, three hours. That'll put us into the prime of day. It doesn't sound good outside, no. Today, we need to go on an expedition to get the bedroll, because I want that bedroll. And so we're going to need to bring a weapon and a crowbar. Bring this low condition crowbar. Do we need this? It will help 
was break down the material in the lighthouse, which is there. So, this. And of course, I think we want to have the rifle. until we're not overweight. And that's all we need to do. And it sounds like the weather has improved. I'm going to equip the torch. It's not too bad. Just towards the broken bridge, and if we go this way, go to the Riken, which is I'd like to run. I'm going to save my stamina, because as Jill has kindly pointed out in his recent video playing with wolves, stamina can help you outrun wolves, and that's very handy to know. Okay, I hear birds. I can't tell where they're coming from. I need to find another corpse. Because it's possible that there might be... Uh, there might be a hatchet or a knife by a corpse. There are birds. That's a good sign. And they're right by the uh, Riken. So it's worth going this way. Following birds is a good idea. Birds, uh, during one of the other uh, episodes... I wasn't recording. I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. And uh, those birds took off when the weather, just before the weather started getting really bad, the birds all took off. So keep that in mind that the wildlife can give you tips and cues about things like wolves and, and other predators and uh, weather. They're right over the Riken, so there must be, there must be a, a corpse up there. Hard to get up here. There we go. And 
there is a corpse here. And hopefully he's got, he does not have any. I'll take it. Okay, some supplies. Anyways. Go down here and see what's down here. Sometimes there's something over here. There are some planks, but I don't think that we have... We're a little bit overweight, so we're going to eat and drink. And hopefully that will get our weight down. This stuff is particularly heavy, so if we eat that, it helps to bring our weight down a little bit. We're down under the limit now. I want to just take a quick run up here. I don't think we've been up here yet. There are a few other places where you can find rifle cartridges. And up here is one of them. Primary objective of of course, is to find a hatchet and a knife. I can't see much in here. Well, the cursor is not lighting up, so that's sort of an indication that there, there isn't any ammo laying around up here. quickly check our status here. We're doing not too bad. It just feels like minus four. So how do we get up here again? Going down these steps. Now let's take a peek over here. See if there's anything here. And look around here. Sometimes there's something over there. That's the little island. We've been over there. There was no corpse there. I was very curious if there was a corpse there because uh, corpses are a place where we can find uh, things like the... I uh, can't really pick that up. Just remember that it's here. Okay, let's get on over to the lighthouse, which is rapidly getting lost in the fog. Well, we may as well take a little joint over here. We're going to use up a little bit of stamina, but we'll get it back. side before and there was a deer carcass over here so there's always a chance that there's uh, feathers here uh, there's rose hips here but I believe yes the rose hips are gone uh, well, that's a green maple sapling that's it is required All right. and there's a feather we'll grab that Two more. Pretty, isn't it? Okay. Well, even though we have big hammer and the uh, this thing is frozen, we cannot harvest those maple saplings. And that's a shame. Oh. And there doesn't seem to be another corpse out here. Just 
three crows. That's it. Let's just head up here because looks like we can get up here. I hope the day is getting warmer. We should, we should be moving into the warmer part of the day. So this is a cedar limb. And we can't break that down even with the hammer. Check our uh, inventory. And we've got that hammer. Need a little something. Stamina should be good now. This, I believe, is a fur. I can't harvest that either. There is a deer. We have eight hours of daylight. Okay, so tempting. But we need a deer. We need to get our uh, sleeping bag so we can uh, harvest a bear. Keep the stamina here. Oh, there's another corpse. Another corpse around here somewhere. There is another bridge over here. Uh oh. That is a deer hybrid. Gave me for a second there. That's a good sign, generally. You're getting foggy. Oh, it's warmed up a little bit. Now oh, we're heading towards this other bridge here because I think there's another corpse up here. processing and if we go up on the highway here the wind is picking up. We still hear crows so that's a good sign. I'm off to the right of us. Okay, we have some wind shot in here. I'm getting a bit cold. Okay yeah so I found the other Hopefully there's a corpse over here. Sorry about that. There's a phone call. I'm going to edit that part out. There's another crowbar. Okay. Oh, useful. I'm going to put his overweight again. Pity that there's nothing there. Uh, we can go inside this truck. Possibly get in there. This could possibly get in there. It doesn't seem to be possible anymore. Well, we can't get inside anymore. Yeah, I guess they fix that. possible to go up onto the highway from there, that end, but we're going to go up here and see if there isn't anything up here that we can grab. There's another waterfall. Oh, there's a deer. There's a lot of other deer. If we lose 
see spiders when it's windy. Because there isn't as many today, and this, this has been here for quite a while, so there should be more feathers now. been around the trees too much so much. Follow this little ridge until we start doing this. And then head up this way. There probably are some corpses in some of these uh, mines, so... Well, this gives us a bit of altitude. But if we do encounter a wolf, we're going to be able to run down here and get away. There's another. If we get to the stone shop, I think we might be coming out at this way. Okay, there's a sleeping bag here we can grab. So that would be good enough. Sounds nice. It sounds warm, well, but okay. We could break down these planks here. Let's take a look at that. Uh, feels like plus one. So uh, our condition is 87%. We didn't get all the way healed up before we left. That's 
what happened. There is a crew over here. hours of daylight left. And we have survived for three uh, six days, three hours. So three minus nine means I think we have about six hours of daylight left. That would uh, explain why it's warm here. Let's break these up. Now, I've never encountered a wolf inside of uh, these places, so... I don't know if they can come in here. We're making enough noise, they might. It's quite warm. Give them more. We're not going to bring this wood with us. We're just going to... We're just going to stockpile it here. For a rainy day. Just a little bit overweight. So we've got 1.2 kilograms of sticks. And we'll drop, we'll just drop a, a couple of these. That's for fire starting. Unfortunately, we don't have enough stuff to make a fire with here. Okay, pretty easy. shelter. Yes, this is a good spot. And we uh, have to get close enough to that wood to, to harvest him. Okay, yes, this is good. Okay. And we'll start a fire. Right here. I forgot that we we also have we didn't drop all of the uh, reclaimed wood or did we? I'm not sure if we dropped it all. Find out in a second. Oh dear.
usually we can get away with this. Starting with a stick and a torch. It's, uh, our fire skill should be pretty good. So I don't know why this is this is giving us uh, so much problem. It's okay because we've got a torch and it will protect us. I believe we brought the pry bar so that we could open this sucker up. I think we've already searched it. Just be prepared for anything. Oh, it wasn't locked. Sure can't outrun a wolf like this, that's for sure. We're heavily burdened down with all this wolf wolf stuff. Yeah, it sure slows you down when you get tired. some wood here, because I didn't bring enough to cook that stuff. The fire ran out a while ago. Damn. Oh. Green wrist? My goodness. Well, if we don't need a weapon, I think we can sleep off that sprained wrist. And we're getting very thirsty. To the lonely lighthouse. What have we got left in here? Ah, there's our precious sleeping bag. And a broken arrow. Er, okay. But the question is, do we have firewood? Oh, we have lots of firewood. Bye. 
We don't have a lot of uh, reclaimed wood here, but we're going to fix that. That's why we brought the axe. And let's put this out. Let's do it. You, eh? We're gonna have to eat, so let's go take a look at that. Uh, we have six of them to cook. That's two hours. Uh, right. And uh, this stuff. At 82%. Mm, we lost quite a bit on that one. I'm going to save that. These are great fruits here. This can be used to warm you up as well. Spare. I think we're gonna need to cook a little bit of water too. I don't think we have any water purification. So even if we melt it, we can't boil it. Yeah. But we're gonna we're gonna make more firewood here. So I could do an experiment and leave some of this wood overnight. I mean, some of this wolf meat overnight and see how much it degrades because it will cook up to nearly 100%. Okay, it's cutting it very fine. So, if we add any more, we have. Take a torch. some water here by the door. handy making fires uh, let's bring all this stuff on as well that's all gonna come back with us I'm gonna leave this here and this here and this I don't think we can we can't probably can't carry that with, with what we've got so I don't think there's anything in here yeah. Sometimes there's an orange silver here. We'll have that. I don't think there's anything else over here. Yeah, these are cleaned out. We must be tired. Yes, we are wearing the red. There's another 
book. Nothing else has spawned in our interim. Take a look at what's weighing us down here. Oh, there's the rifle, there's a bunch of water. And what's the condition of this thing? 79%. Okay. Take a look at our status. We are exhausted and we're just a little bit hungry. We only have a sprained wrist. We're going to sleep that off. The condition is 82. So that will be fixed up. So let's go back to inventory, eat some of this. temperature in here oh it's minus one so so this is a colder place the warmest building in the establishment seems to be back in the Hibernia plant uh, this is minus one and it is uh, above freezing there so you could you could sleep without any uh, worry there actually you get a warmth bonus from the bed but uh, you do better when you sleep in a warm place and I think there's any repair we can do. Uh, we didn't. Uh, well, we could do some harvesting. That's what I meant to do. Harvesting is boring, isn't it? Yeah, hopefully we'll let me be able to figure out how to accelerate some of this stuff. I know I'm going to have to figure out how to edit out a piece of that video because I got a phone call in the middle of the recording. So that takes care of that. Uh, do we have any burnt out torches to harvest? It appears not. Kilos, that's pretty heavy. We need to bring almost all this stuff back with us, though. Uh, can't we leave? Oh, what? Uh oh, what? Well, we're going to be lighter because of that food. Uh, we could leave some of this medicine here. Okay, but it's not going to—it's not going to weigh very much. 0 0.70 kilograms. These do add up, yeah. Wonder why they, they have condition, you know? Okay, uh, we have six hours of darkness. So let's sleep for six hours. I do want to uh, I do want to break up a bit of firewood here and leave it here before we leave. And we're gonna do that during daylight hours. And we're gonna take a little nap before we leave as well. And we're gonna drink. Of course we're gonna eat this this uh Condition has gone down to 99% overnight. It was 100%. Everything goes down by 1% a day. This is going to reduce our weight a little bit. Okay.
can't grab the radio. and just hope that uh, yeah, it's still empty but there's something new in here hmm, fishing tackle that comes in handy for repairing clothes more antiseptic we're gonna leave some of this antiseptic behind Other locker. One hatchet, knife. Maybe. Still minus one in here. Use like ten. Uh, our clothing inside keeps us nice and warm. And that will take thirty-four minutes. What time is it? Uh, it. it we got Eight hours of daylight. Yeah, it's almost time for us to head on down the road. Okay, well. That will yield six. This will yield three. Thirty-four minutes. Ten minutes thick. Uh, yeah. Ten minutes a stick. That one's only 45 minutes. But you only get four sticks. Uh oh. Oh, I gave up. Oh, it's time to drink water. Yes, indeed. We are thirsty. Hard work, isn't it? I don't like the sound of that weather. Usually at this time of the day, the weather's a little bit better, but it is, uh, let's see, three, survive for three hours, three minus nine is six, so there's about six hours of daylight left, and this is the, what the weather sounds like, so. Let's go take a peek outside. on the weather. Oh, it's nasty. Feels like zero. Feels like minus one. It is getting colder. And so, yeah. We are low on calories. I'm gonna start starting any second. Oh yeah, that, that looks terrible out there. 
it is dropping the air temperature is dropping rapidly so so we're not going anywhere but it folks we're gonna have to weather it out here chunks of wolf meat left. Ooh, the weather is, uh, the wind is dropping. Okay, that gives us a hundred thousand. That's enough to sleep through the night. And we might need to beat feet. Uh, I'm sorry, folks. Oops, we just got tired then. Yep, we just got drained. Okay. for that matter. to get it. Condition that rule. Maybe so that's a better condition. Yeah, we're gonna have to go hunting very soon. 
This stuff will come in handy. Tad thirsty and hungry. Yep, we go through that stuff fast. We're gonna eat this. fairly heavy. But it has lots of calories. Okay, we're down to 20, 20 kilograms. That's why we're we're just so tired. That's why. And we got 10 hours of darkness. So let's sleep for nine. No, let's sleep for 10. Let's sleep for 12. We can make it. And I think I'm going to end this episode right here. Thank you for watching. Quick look at our. Ooh, we're dehydrated. That's alright. We're gonna drink. We'll take care of that right away. And we're out of water. And we're still thirsty, so we have to make fire. But, anyways, I'm gonna quit right here. And we'll catch you on the next episode.